it goes up to your nipple. Watch this. Oh my God. <laughs> what the? Whoa! Watch, watch with the yawning. That's no way to start the 15 Come minute morning show. Oh, are you kidding? We've been up for, for like how long? Six hours at this point? This is a, this is a long time day. For grandpa. Oh, it, don't you guys? What at what point did you know you were getting old, Danielle? Start well, with what you. Po- oh, when I get off the oh. couch now, sometimes and I go, oh, that hurts. Like, and then that's yeah. when you know it's settling yeah. in. It's settling in. I I knew I was getting old when I preferred slip-on sneakers to laced ones. Okay, that's just lazy ass. <laughs> because I just love not having to bend over or sit down and tie shoes. I like to just. Take my feet in the morning and just be like, oh, slide in one, slide in two. I could say something else about that, but it wouldn't be very nice, so I'll keep it to myself. What you talking about, Nothing, nothing, nothing. I don't know. I don't feel old. I know that that's like a terrible answer, but I don't feel old ever. I mean, I guess maybe some of the trends that are back now from when we were in like elementary yeah. school, I guess that would make you feel old. Cause Such like, as? My da- well, my mom always used to be like, oh, I used to wear those pants when I was 10 yes, years old. Yes. And now I see like, what? you know, flared jeans and stuff are back. And I'm like, I used to wear those pants when I was 10 years old. Yeah. Like, why are we doing this again? So I guess that would be one. Okay. But physically, I feel yeah. good. Yeah. Elvis? Hi, surprise. <laughs> At what point did you feel or know you were old? Oh, this morning, getting out of bed. There you go. <laughs> okay. That's, it, Danielle said the same old thing. Old or adult? I mean, w- w- which angle? Uh, old, old. Old. Old, oh, yeah, like decrepit. I, said, I don't feel yeah. old. I don't, I'm not leaning into this. <laughs> Well, you're the youngest one in the room. Froggy, so, right. I feel like you're kind of decrepit at oh. this point in life. God, yeah. no, I my am. God, what a bitch. You keep saying no, he bitchy knows. mean things He knows people. he's getting decrepit. I'm he's decrepit. Not decrepit. He's not decrepit. Neither of you are decrepit. But Froggy is not decrepit. I do. Maybe you are, Nate, but... I knew I was you're... getting older when I struggled to <laughs> reach down and touch my toes or put my socks on. I'm like, yeah, this is yeah. not good. There yeah. you go. You know what? You said something, uh, Gandhi. If yeah. you're good, if you're getting old, just lean into it. Well, that's what I do. I lean into walls. Oh God! Ah. Really? So you support yourself. Well, you know what? No, you know what? You can feel it's 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 a different world standing up and and having balance. And no, you, you can feel it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There's that. My know- mom, my mom's taking a balance class with all of her girlfriends oh. because they keep falling into stuff. She's <laughs> and well, she's at that age. Maybe they're all just drunk. She's in her seventies. It's so. true. We keep falling yeah. into shit. So she goes. I'm so excited. I'm taking this balance class, and every week they go and they love it. They I love should start class. doing balance class. Yeah, it's probably a good idea for all of us. See, I'm I feel t- like old. Why are you? I was laughing at me. No, you don't need a balance class. I've never seen you fall down. Oh, I fall. Uh, yeah. uh, I, you, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What well, was that? Yes, but when he fell, it was intoxication. It was okay. That doesn't count. Yeah, doesn't by count. the way, Elvis, when you fall, you fall. <laughs> like, you just don't fall. You fall. <laughs> Mine's kind of related to Froggy's. I have uh, a <laughs> little athlete's foot, and I couldn't reach oh. down to put the, the the paste in between my toes. See, this is a multi-layered that gross conversation. That is just nastiness. How does I athlete's foot come up? Like, I've, how do you get it? I feel like I'm getting Moist older. Area. I can't put my entire fist up my asshole. <laughs> oh, God. That used to be able to. That makes me See, feel I, real I think old is much more a state of mind. I don't look at anybody in this room as being old. Yeah. The oldest person, I would say, is Scotty. Yeah. And he's not the oldest. He just acts like he's well, 120. Yeah. Well, today, I'm probably going to find out I have an optometrist appointment. I think I need glasses. So no, that's how I'm going to feel That old. doesn't mean you're old. Little kids wear glasses. Yeah, Everybody, well, well, like, you know, come on. I've had really good vision for a very long time. Now, all of a sudden, I can't see close up. No, that's what happens. I remember th- yep. that's the day I felt old. Uh, the I readers. could see one day, and I could not see the next day. And they say that's yeah. that's how it happened. Oh, it, it's like overnight. Yep. Poof. Yeah. Oh, my favorite and then they is... found out my retina was detached. Oh, oh, okay, well, that's yeah. the thing. For me. Sheldon refuses. To, he refused for the longest time to put on the reading glasses like he needed them. So he would hold the phone or whatever he was reading practically on the other side of the room. I'm like, do you want me to take this paper outside so you can actually see it? Put on your phone. Freaking glasses. Mm-hmm. It's so ridiculous. Well, that's me with my hearing now. I really probably should get hearing aids because oh. I've got ringing in my ears. And oh, all awesome. Nate. So, yeah. like, we go out to, like, eat, and I'm like, huh? Wait, you what? need to do what? Hmm? Hearing <laughs> aids. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, fine. How are you? <laughs> what, what's going on right now? Wait, by the way, what happened with your He's GERD? Gonna... Did you oh, go get that check? I'm That's taking, an old thing. I'm Another take, old thing. <laughs> yeah. Well, I take my Pepsi Complete every day now. Oh, my God. <laughs> and then I take some Tums as necessary. All right. Nate does more old man me? stuff than anybody else well, does. Well... I don't know. Scotty's wearing control top panties today. <laughs> he is. <laughs> you have to be old to have something called GERD happening in your body. No, 
No, that's our joke. Our joke about being deaf. Yeah. It's like you say something and then just say. Anything. Oh, I get it now. Fine. How are you? <laughs> what if you but move I, into like a like a retirement community? Are you considering like looking at your? You know, a house for he's like not your, old enough. He's not even close old, to no. old enough. Fifty five. Would that I've be looked. something? Would that be considered getting older? Or if you spend more time on Facebook than you do on Instagram, that's probably like, oh yeah. I mean, everyone's getting older at every second of every day. Yeah. They're all doing it at the What's same time. Right now, you're, you're older. Yeah. The only you're thing older. other than getting right older now. is you drop dead, Scary. Yeah. You want to drop dead? You're older scary. now. Scary, <laughs> you were older now than you were when this conversation started. Oh, I know. Yeah. Oh, you are the youngest. Right now, you will ever be again. Yep. You know, like, the, okay, True. this is how you really know you're old. So David Katz, your business partner. Yes. I golfed with him and his two friends that he went to high school with. So they're all almost 60. And them catching up was fucking hilarious. <laughs> he goes, hey, do you remember Ray Johnstone? Yeah, he's dead now. Oh, God. And, uh, <laughs> oh, so oh, my God. <laughs> they, they start dropping that's my flag, man. Friends, hey, that's horrible. Yeah, yeah, do you remember Stevie? Yeah, he's been dead for like five years, but his wife is getting like... <laughs> Like, oh my God. Well, I used to call my mom and dad and they would give me the weekly death report. Yeah. <laughs> no. And it was almost like, oh yeah, here's the list of everyone who died this week. My parents wow. would do the same thing. But like, that's got to be so sad because yeah. when you start to get to that age where you start going to more and more funerals of all your friends, right. like you have to be sitting there thinking, gosh, will mine be next? Like well, seriously. Yeah. But think about, think about it this way. Maybe it's actually a pretty cool point in your life where you know you have a finite number of days left no matter what. Oh, wow. Oh. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. About it's that. like you start, you know, looking at life through a different lens and, and appreciating life more when you know you're about to fucking die. It is weird because yes. there are things you go through. Like you go through the period where you go to a lot of young kids' birthday parties because your friends are having young kids. Or you go to a lot of weddings because a lot of your friends are getting married. When you get older, you, you go to a lot of funerals because all your friends are dying. I mean, that is kind of the natural you go progression. You to the diner every Thursday. Oh, my God, that's my father. <laughs> I was just about to bring this up. He's got his Thursday night crew, and then yeah. he's got his Friday morning crew. My dad and, had the same crew every morning. That's Monday nice. through Friday. They always did coffee every morning. Aww. Yeah, coffee. They go for coffee. They go oh for my coffee. God. Yeah. My grandpa did the McDonald's yeah. Mafia. They had the corner booth. There were six guys, <laughs> and they just sit there for hours drinking coffee. The cronies. Talking. The cronies. Yeah. Yeah, my grandfather would do that in front of 7-Eleven with, like, his boys. <laughs> like, they would sit there every morning drinking coffee. It was like, who, who do you think you are sitting mm -hmm. out there like a tough guy? They're you, enjoying it. But you, does anybody do this at restaurants? Use your cell phone to look at the menu with the light? Yep. Uh, I yeah. I have, yeah. Not yet. All right, well, that's not a sign you're old then. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I really think we should focus on Scotty's control top panties today. They're not control top panties. I'm just worried. <laughs> there's there's no control whatsoever. Elvis saw them and goes, what the fuck is that? Well, first of all, he's you must understand. He's that pulling his underwear I, past his nipples, and I'm not kidding. <laughs> I he lost him. a lot of weight, so maybe they don't fit him. I get, show him how you do it. I show get him. dressed in the dark, and I pull whatever underwear is on the top of the thing. So the show him how high it goes. Show him how high it goes. Up to your nipple. Watch this. <laughs> Oh my <laughs> What the fuck is that? Yes. Guys, those Scotty, are not yours. Why? <laughs> they are. Whose are those? No, they're mine. They're they're like these satin Joe Boxer boxer shorts. <laughs> How big are they? Oh my god, they're probably Scott. extra large. Like, is that all the way up your butt at that point? When <laughs> yeah, you no. it, it must be cinching something below. No, it's still comfortable. That's how big those things are. That's I was Scotty, like, Scotty, you can put Christ. three people in those. I might. How far can you get the, Can you get them to your head? No, that's as far as they can go before they rip. He Wait. can make a frock out of the fabric. <laughs> Since that's we're crazy. talking about underwear, can you show your underwear? Oh, those things we got? <laughs> oh, okay, God. well, who sent these to you? I don't know. I just, Danielle came in and, like, threw them at me and was like, this is <laughs> Danielle real. said, hey, here's some period panties. <laughs> I was like, so, so I these said, who wants mine? I don't want them. But they're purple period <laughs> panties. Wait, they're not only purple. These are the biggest things I've ever seen. They're they're probably what Scotty's wearing. Shut up. <laughs> Oh, my How big those God. are. Wait, wait. Go, go just slip into those. Slip into something more comfortable. I'm going to put these over my wait, pants right now, and i probably make, pull them up to my boobs. What makes them period panties? Do they so, have, like, a... The I mean, not to get too descriptive, but they've got, like, an absorbent thing in here. Oh, so just in case. Okay. So, yeah, you're supposed okay. to be able to... Passed around to every whatever. female at every oh, radio station. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know who like, sent them. Mine, oh, okay, they're okay. Let's, let's be nice. Yeah. Can we yes. pee in them? We can try. Do you want to try? Not right now, but These sure. are about the same size as what you got on. Right. <laughs> it was very nice of them to send them. It was, it was but, very, very polite. Yeah, but, yes. Absolutely. Why do I think that Scotty's had female pa panties on before? And I hate that word, but why? why do sure I think he has. Once? I remember once. There's a picture of me somewhere once. It was in the 90s. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> That's not a turn on for me. Sure. I, I don't know if some guys get into me that. Either. No, it wasn't. We were just messing around. Ladies just undies? Can't, I can't. Hold on. Like we were messing around. Who were you underwear? with when you put women's underwear on? Uh, my name? old girlfriend. Oh, okay. Yeah. 
What, what, what? What do you want okay, to say? Okay, so. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. My heart just skipped a beat. <laughs> I've never surprised I'm so anything turned on. that comes out of his mouth. I see. <laughs> every, well, that guy, every guy has tried on some girly panties. No. No. I, no, he hasn't. I have not. Man on an island, by the oh, no. Yeah. I put on my mother's pantyhose when I was a kid. There you go. Okay, that's they good. I did that one time. What? There was a, I used to work in a store that would, do you remember the, do you remember the legs pantyhose that would come in the eggs egg, on that, yes, on that yes. rack? Yeah. I took one off one time, went in the back room and tried them on. Yes. Did you put them back in the egg and I sell them? I did not. Them? No, I didn't. I threw them okay. out. Oh, sure. And then you threw them away? Yeah. I didn't like the way they felt. <laughs> well, who are you talking to, Danielle? What's My going husband. on? Yeah, put them on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm putting you on speaker. Hold on. Hold on. I'll call Brandon, too, if you want. Hi, Sheldon. Uh, yes, hello. It's hey. always such a pleasure to, to receive you. <laughs> so we're talking about and every, uh, like Scotty said, every guy has tried on women's panties at one time or another. So I'm calling you to ask you. Well, I guess I'm just that anomaly because mm-hmm. not in my wildest thoughts have I ever been curious <laughs> to try on women's panties. There you go. Panties. 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 Oh, the way you panties. say that's even more disgusting. <laughs> Punties. Punties. All right, thank you, honey. Punties. Love you. What a punch, Sheldon. What a punties. Punties. He goes, I'm on the phone Don't with Don't they my call mom. them knickers the there or something like knickers. that? Knickers. Knickers. Aren't those like a totally different, like, floofy, frilly thing? I don't know. They call, I, I think they call them yeah. knickers in uh, Aren't those The Crown. I've never been there. It's The Crown. crown. Hey, what else? I think oh. we're done. Are we done? Oh, is that oh, it? Oh, here he is. Hey, wait, I got a oh, question. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> we're asking Brandon if he's Brandon. ever worried. Hi, Brandon. Warm, You're on the speakerphone with everybody. Um, in your life, have you ever tried on women's underwear? <laughs> Liar. <laughs> I love Brandon. No, just no. shut the what, the. what are you even asking? Okay, thanks. Okay, go back to work. Love you. Bye. <laughs> he's now no, he's got please. coworkers around him. He's going. My girlfriend just <laughs> called me and asked. Yes. Me. You don't even need okay, to. Okay, here we go. <laughs> See if Alex answers. <laughs> Why are we doing this? I don't know. To prove to Scotty prove wrong. Scotty wrong. <laughs> okay. Scotty swears everyone has worn it. Every guy has. And there's Sam's no. fiance. Oh, oh I bet he has. Sam's, <laughs> Sam's fiance girl, will. If, if oh, he's probably wearing them right now. I, would, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if Sam's fiance. If you have a girlfriend def- that has. He, you know. he definitely tried. Well, let me go ask He's definitely, uh, definitely Alex tried. knows we're calling about women's panties. He's not answering <laughs> on purpose. All right, Scotty, what were you saying? If you have a girlfriend that what? I was just going to say, if you have a girlfriend that's He's, fun or whatever, and you're just screwing around, and, and, and they don't say, hey, try these on? I, no. no. Hi, Will. Hi, Will. Hey, hey, what's up? Hey. Have you ever, or are you currently wearing women's panties? Ever. Women's panties. Just yeah. try yeah. it on Have once. you ever tried them on? Yes. Ah! I told you. I told you. I told you. I could have I could made a lot of money off of this. Are you wearing them right now? I wish. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, thank you. No problem. We used you for what we needed. (laughs) (laughs) That's all I ask for. (laughs) Well, everyone. And with that, goodbye. See ya.